Hi there, it's Jen from ModernMedicineLady.com and the Empathic Woman System, and the word of the day is strain. So I've been thinking a lot lately about how, at least from my perspective, there are two kind of fundamental ways to live. And one is about really going with the flow, allowing life to be easy, finding a way to make pretty much everything some kind of play and finding the delight and the joy and the lesson and the wonder in all things that we encounter and especially having no preconceived notions about what the outcome is going to look like, about how it's going to all play out and just continuing to see where life carries us and takes us while at the same time being willing to just keep on taking one step after another and being persistent and consistent but taking actions and letting go of the results and for me this is generally a life of allowing a life of surrender and a life of ease the other life at least in my experience is the life of strain where it's all about wanting a particular outcome having a really really particular agenda going on and trying to force it trying to basically decide I know what's best and so I'm just gonna push and push and push and push and push until I get my way and what I've noticed over the years is that when I am in the first way which is the path of surrender and allowance then life has this amazing way of unfolding beautifully for me and it's sweet and it's easy and there's gratitude and delight and amazing miraculous things just keep on happening on a regular basis and when I find myself sort of sliding into the other side which is where I end up straining and trying to force an outcome or have some kind of willful agenda about what it is that I want to happen that usually ends up kind of turning into one big mess for me because so much of my energy is going into trying to force an outcome that I'm kind of literally straining a muscle well I guess not literally more metaphorically straining a muscle it's kind of like spiritual muscle strain and I end up feeling exhausted and tired and overwhelmed and frustrated because so often in my experience life goes the way that it wants to go it flows and it moves and it does amazing things and it's not about my idea of the way that it's gonna go but when I'm invested and I'm straining a lot of times I'll just feel so frustrated because it's not happening the way I'm expecting it to be happening and what I've noticed is that there's almost sometimes the only way to know that I'm straining is when I start feeling that sort of mental, emotional, even physical exhaustion and that sort of sense of I've been pushing and pushing and pushing. But other times I can kind of sense the choice of either going down one road or going down another and which one do I want to choose do I want to choose the path of less resistance do I want to choose the path of miraculous possibility or do I want to choose the path of self will run riot Jen knows what's best and she's gonna to try to force the outcome so my question to you right now is do you generally live a life of strain or do you live a life of ease do you try to force things into being the way you want them to be or do you allow life to be on life's terms and if you're noticing that maybe you've been straining a little bit more than usual how can you let that go a little bit how can you basically kind of you know back off the gas pedal and and allow yourself to sort of move over to the passenger seat and let the universe drive for a little while. So I would love to hear what you have to say about all of this. Please leave a comment below. And until next word of the day, I am wishing you peace, I'm wishing you ease, and I am wishing you freedom from strain. So in the meantime, please go subscribe to my YouTube channel, Jennifer Moore, Modern Medicine Lady. And also, I would be eternally grateful for your help to get this video out into the world. So please like it. Please share it. Please pass it along to other people who would find it useful. Thank you so much. And until tomorrow, peace.